Hey, Sheldon sent us all an email. Happy holidays from Texas. And there's pictures. Ah, oh, don't open them. Do not open them. <laughs> oh, come on. Childbirth is a natural, beautiful. Oh, it's like someone sawed a cow in half. <laughs> My father's a gynecologist. I think I can handle it. And uh, now I'm gay. You know, I was thinking, without Sheldon, most of us would have never met, but Penny would still live across from him. And with Leonard out of the picture, we all know what that would mean. We do? Hey, Sheldon. Hello. Doing laundry. <laughs> of course I'm doing laundry. Saturday night is laundry night, and I'm in a laundry room, so I believe your inference is justified. <laughs> My inference is justified. Sheldon, you are so funny. <laughs> anyway, I need to do my laundry, too, because these clothes are so dirty. Almost as dirty as the dirty girl who's wearing them. <laughs> OK, that's enough. Disagree. Keep going. <laughs> so, what do you think? A tad asymmetrical, but nothing to be concerned about. Please, Sheldon, I need you. To what? Take me. I'm not taking you anywhere till you put on a shirt. <laughs> Come on, Sheldon. You and me, right here. Penny, for the thousandth time, I'm saving myself for someone special. You know, perhaps a cute, bespectacled neuroscientist with hair the color of mud. <laughs> I think I know how to change your mind. That's not. <laughs> I was okay with it. <laughs> How's it going, Sheldon? Actually, much better. Oh, good. Is the baby born yet? I don't know. I just got back. Where'd you go? My mother asked me to get some towels. I took advantage of the vague request and went to Bed Bath & Beyond. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm on the phone. <laughs> So rude. 